In pursuing our academic goals, it is important that we take the time to gauge where we are scholastically. The completion of midterms is just such a time. At this point in the semester, it is crucial that we understand what grade we are receiving in a given course. But it is even more important to be able to forecast the effects of a given grade on our overall GPA. While I know it is impossible to break the future, you can make an educated guess as to how your midterm grades will affect your overall GPA. To that end, UW Richland has provided a useful tool, creatively christened, the GPA Calculator. The GPA Calculator can be found in the Current Students section of the UW Richland website. Now, you don't have to be a math major to figure out your GPA. The process is a straightforward one. Simply insert your expected letter grade in the left-hand column with the number of credits that each course is worth in the right hand. So here we go. Say I take a music course, I get an A in it, and it's worth two credits. You type in the A move over to the credits and click 2. I also took a chemistry course with Dr. Federley and because he liked my jokes I got an A in that too and that was worth 5 credits. I also took a philosophy course for a B for 3 credits and an English course for an A and that's of course in Marty's is a 3 too. Next scroll down and click calculate your GPA. Voila! There you will get your full GPA for this semester. Now, if you want to check your overall GPA, you type in your most previous GPA into the first box, then the number of credits including what you expect to get this semester, whether you have them yet or not. Click Calculate, and that will be where you are currently sitting. I know figuring out your GPA can be a pain, but knowing where your grades are now, especially after midterms, can really help you decide if you're on the right path or need to put in a little extra effort for the rest of the semester.